Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Light Elvis, and I'm here to talk about dreams. But firstly, I'd like to start with a story. In a small village lived a boy called Liam. Wakes up every morning with a dream of becoming a pilot. But his friend didn't have the funds, the money, to take him to the high institution. But he never gave up. He continued fervently day and night. That would have been the point where he had to give up all hope. But no, he continued. And finally, he flew on the sky. He rode a plane. From this story, we can see that dreams move people to, towards greatness. Our dreams are what make us move forward in life because we want to see them become reality. Eliana Roosevelt once said, the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of our dreams. Our dreams provide us with the motivation and determination to reach our goals. Without dreams, humans will lack ambition. Dreams are the beautiful imagination that one takes to escape from ruthless reality. Sometimes people incline to dreams and live a fictional life. This may be to ignore the difficulties and struggles they may come across in life. There are other kinds of dreams that do not allow a person to sleep until they achieve it. This kind of dream are very important for success and fame. Have you ever dreamt of where you'd be in the next five years? In what situation would you be in? Many people blame that their lives are not good enough yes. and not interesting enough too. Everyone thinks that they want to achieve something big, but most of them have not devoted the time to think if, of what it can be for them. We must have the resolution for dreaming big, but also the intelligence to plan. Thus, we need to have the willpower to work for our dream. This is a fact that the path that leads to our dream is never an easy one. The only people who see our vision is only we. You need to know something. The great people of our time are not the ones who never feared fearful, but the ones who learned to overcome their fears. Show by hands those of you who have learned to overcome your fears. Please give her a mic. Okay. Overcome your fears. I've learned how to overcome my fears by counting from one to five and calm myself down. Okay. Even me standing before you just learned how to overcome my fears. I was so fearful to stand before all of you today. But standing here before you has made me forget about my fears. I would like to say that if every one of us can overcome our fears and work towards our dream, tomorrow can be in a better place. Our future can be bright. Finally, I say, a person without a dream is like a bird without wing. Life is a sequence of challenges. We may want to give up or we can keep hoping. We may want to give up or we may keep hoping. This calls for a lot of sweat and blood too. So never fear to dream. Thank you. You are welcome. Like Chinoye Elvis from Highgate School, presenting on dreams. Mr. Elomza, what will you say to light? You have done work. The confidence point, the voice, you engage the work. Your statements, your creativity, adding a story. Uh, I love it. Uh, thank you very much. Keep it up. Whatever happens here, you are good. Whatever happens here, know that you are good. Thank you, Light Chinoye from Highgate School.